This ABC 15 News Update is sponsored by Sanderson Ford, America's best-selling Ford dealership. Good morning, I'm Justin Pizzera with your morning update from ABC 15 Arizona. In Tucson, loved ones gather to say their final farewells to a Gilbert man who was killed in a terror attack overseas. A funeral for Dustin Harrison held on Saturday. The 47-year-old was working as a contractor for the Department of Defense when the group Al-Shabaab attacked a military base in Kenya. His wife describing Dustin as her soulmate and saying their two-year-old daughter was his everything. I, I feel in a way that she's been cheated, that we've been cheated, but in the same sense, when you love, it's, there are going to be scars. Family and friends describe Harrison as a quiet man, but they say that he did, he died doing what he loves, serving his country. Those affected by the 2017 Equifax data breach only have days to file a claim for free. The deadline to file a claim as part of the settlement is Wednesday after the data breach. Equifax agreed to pay $700 million to settle federal and state investigations. The breach compromised personal information belonging to nearly 147 million people. Happening today in downtown Downtown Phoenix, the 2020 Women's March, thousands expected to rally outside the state capitol. This year's theme, Women Rising, marching, mobilizing, and making history. The march comes a day after cities across the country held their own demonstrations. I know we also have some runners out there as well who will be hitting the trails today. So by 8 a.m. 45 degrees for you. Then by 11 a.m. 63 degrees with mostly sunny skies. Then by 3 p.m. we'll warm to 74 degrees. Our forecast high today a little bit warmer at 75 degrees. Partly cloudy skies, but mostly sunny and beautiful. So get out and enjoy it if you can. Here's your forecast and highs all across the state today. To the west, we're in the 70s to 60s. There are 69 degrees in Quartzsite, 45 at the Grand Canyon, 50 in Winslow, 43, 44 degrees, excuse me, right now there in Heber, 49 degrees in Cholo and 66 degrees in Safford. Those are your forecasted highs today. Here's that seven day forecast for you looking beautiful for us. So 75 today, then 72 tomorrow. Then we do have a 10% shot of storms in the valley on Tuesday. We're sticking in the 70s though through the rest of the week. Take a look at this Thursday, Friday, 71 before Saturday. We warm just to 72 degrees. We'll have another update this afternoon until then get the latest news, weather and traffic at abc15.com or you can download our free ABC 15 mobile app. This ABC 15 news update is sponsored by Sanderson Ford, America's best-selling Ford dealership.